Welcome to the Folktale Project, this is Dan Shaws. Today we have the first story from Mainz in Legends of the Rhine. This story is not, as so many before have been, about a prince or a king. This is about a poet, one of the most celebrated poets of the late medieval period, a middle high German poet named Heinrich Frauenlob. The priest, or as some say canon, in the old town of Mainz was a very worthy man, and at the same time a heaven-gifted singer. Besides devoting himself to science, he composed numerous pious verses which he dedicated to the Holy Virgin. He also played the harp and wrote many beautiful songs in honor of the female sex. In contrast to many contemporary poets, he considered woman a higher title than wife, which only signifies a married woman. So, on account of the chivalry displayed in his numberless poems and songs, posterity gave him the name of Frauenlob, under which title he is better known than under his own name of Heinrich of Meissen. The love and veneration which thankful women paid him was very great not only during his lifetime, but even more so after his death. Their grief was intense when it became known that the poet's voice would never more be heard in this world. It was agreed to honor him with such a burial as no poet had ever before received. The funeral procession moved slowly and sorrowfully along the streets, the greater part of the cortege being women in deep mourning who prayed for the repose of the poet's soul. Eight of the most beautiful among them carried the coffin, which was covered with sweet-scented flowers. At the grave, songs of lamentation were heard from women's gentle voices. Precious Rhine wine, which had been the poet's favorite drink, and which so often had inspired his poetry, was poured by hands of his admirers over his grave. So profusely, the legend relates, that the entrance of the church was flooded by the libation but still more precious than all these gifts were the tears, which on this memorable day were shed by many a gentle lady. The wanderer can still see the monument erected to this great benefactor in the cathedral at Mainz, which represents the figure of a beautiful woman in pure white marble, placing a wreath on the coffin of the great singer, who had honored women in the most chivalrous of songs. And that is the story of Heinrich of Meissen, a priest and a poet and a most chivalrous man. This is Dan Scholes for the Folktale Project. Don't forget that you can subscribe to the podcast on Apple Podcasts, Stitcher, Google Play, Overcast, anywhere you like to get your podcasts. You can follow us on Twitter at Folktale Project. You can find us on Auto Radio, TuneIn Radio, iHeartRadio, Spotify, anywhere you like to listen. And you can always head over to folktaleproject.com, where you'll find a new story waiting for you every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. As always, thank you so much for listening.